This is Kudrow Key. This is where Hurricane Irma made landfall. This is really ground zero. And you can see when it came through here, it had so much force. The winds blasted through these homes. In fact, over here, this is a washing machine that was thrown across the street. And if we can take a live look right now from our drone, you can see that type of devastation stretches from the bay all the way into this neighborhood. All around the Keys, the remnants of Irma are apparent. Waterways clogged with what was once in people's homes. Shipwrecks now lining the small islands here. And in Kudjo Key, survivors of the hurricane so many feared. When it finally hit us and it came in, it started rocking the house. We were in a two-story cement house. This is video Brian Hawley shot as Irma pounded the Keys. The whole house started shaking. It felt like an earthquake. Almost a full day of winds of over 100 miles an hour. It looked like a nuclear bomb went off. Emergency crews think 10,000 people stayed behind to face Irma. Those who didn't evacuate are just happy to be safe. It's okay. Everybody's safe. Everybody's safe. Everybody's safe? Yeah. No problems. And even happier when we tell them their daughter wanted us to check on them. Uh, you want to talk to your mom or your dad first? This family able to reconnect with a quick call on a sat phone. Hey, sweetie. I'm good, Mom. How are you? We're okay. Everything is good here, and uh, I will. right now we don't need anything. To use your word, the okay. stuff, the stuff is gone, but, <laughs> but we're okay. Right now, there is no food, no water, no electricity. First responders are in triage mode. Their supplies and communication limited. Thankfully, reinforcements are beginning to arrive. It'll be months before things are back to normal. Power is out to all of the Keys, part of the nearly 8 million Floridians without electricity because of the storm. And even though the damage is substantial, it could have been much worse. In Key West, unmistakable landmarks like Duval Street, Margaritaville, Ernest Hemingway's home, battered but still standing. Just like those who survived the storm, now ready to rebuild. But Key West will be strong as ever. We're good. Now, one thing that's important to note, particularly for residents here, if we take another live look from our drone, you can see if you look very closely, there is a lot to clean up out here. But those homes, they may have some roof damage. There is damage all around. But most of those homes are concrete, and most of those homes are still standing. Let me show you what I'm talking about uh, down here. This is one of the homes that took a direct hit from Hurricane Irma. And you can see there is damage. Everything ripped through the homes. But the concrete itself, the concrete structure, is still standing. And for the last two days, we've been touring all the way up and down the Florida Keys. We have damage. Matt and Savannah, back all right. to you. Gotti, thank you very much. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.